In this procedure, we will be replacing a dexter axle bearing cups, cones, and seal with lipper parts. First, remove the dust cap by using a flathead screwdriver to pry it out from the hub assembly. Rotate the hub assembly and pry evenly around the edge until it comes free. Next, remove the tang washer. And then remove the axle nut. Remove the spindle washer and outer bearing from the hub. Then remove the hub from the brake assembly. Using a clean rag, clean all the grease off the spindle. Use wood blocks to support the hub securely in place. Using a seal puller, pull the seal out of the hub. Then remove the inner bearing. Clean inside the hub and bore. Use a brass punch and mallet to tap out the inner bearing cup. Then repeat the process for the outer bearing cup. Thoroughly clean the hub. Insert inner bearing cup into a hub bore. Use the seal driver to seat the cup in place. Flip hub over and repeat process with the outer bearing cup. Apply grease onto bearing cups. Next, we want to pack the bearings. Have a clean surface prepared to set the packed bearings onto. Apply a generous amount of grease into the palm of your hand. You will then want to press the widest end of the bearing into the outer edge of the grease pile. This will force the grease into the inner area of the bearing between two adjacent rollers. Slowly continue this process from roller to roller around the bearing to ensure a good even coating. Once packed, insert the inner bearing into the hub. Next, install the bearing seal using either a block of wood or the bearing cup seat tool.
install hub onto brake assembly. Then insert the outer bearing into the hub bore. Next, insert the spindle washer. You can now install the axle nut until it is finger tight. Next, grab your torque wrench and set it to 50 foot-pounds to torque down the axle nut. Then loosen nut and re-tighten finger tight again. Then install the tang washer. And finally, install the dust cap by gently tapping it into place with a rubber mallet.